Howdy folks, just completed what I consider to be the ultimate Sega Saturn mod. Hardwired in a action replay cart to the Saturn. The cart slot failed. As you can see, hardwiring in there. The action replay cart is sitting right here, just under the inside of the case just in front of the CD drive on the edge of the case. It's an extremely tight fit. Had to route the wires around outside so it wouldn't conflict with the door opening and closing mechanism. This guy here. See more wires down there a little bit. The green in there. You can also maybe see the anti-static bag there through the uh, lid clip that is uh, enclosing the action replay cart so it doesn't accidentally short out to anything. And I also added an on-off switch on pin A45, which basically enables or disables the cart. And that's obviously not the most elegant solution there, but it will be enclosed within the battery and video CD card area if I put that that lid on so it's about as clean as that's going to get without modifying the exterior of the case so let's demonstrate the functionality here currently have the action replay cart off Alright, I think you can see clearly the Saturn is fully functional there with cart disabled. Now we'll put in import game, X-Men vs. Street Fighter, which also requires the 4 megabyte extension, basically utilizing all the functions of the cart. So there you go, running an import game which requires 4 megabyte extension, all via a hardwired action replay cart. Next step is going to be to flash the cart with pseudo, -Sai, pseudo Saturn Kai uh, to also get the ability to play backup games. And once that's complete, uh, that will mark the completion of this project. So, be back soon. Howdy again, folks. Well, we're back after a bit of hassle with the swap trick. Finally got it. Got the AR cart flashed with pseudo Saturn Kai Lite. 
gonna give a run on Final Fight Revenge here. Backup copy, just to demonstrate the functionality. Again, got an action replay cart completely concealed within the case here, hardwired to the cartridge slot port. And uh, also have an on off switch on pin A45 so the cart can be enabled or disabled at my leisure. Again, a backup copy being played, and we'll go ahead and test out X-Men vs. Street Fighter, Japanese import game on a U.S. console here, which also uses the 4 megabyte RAM extension. So we'll exercise the region bypass and the 4 megabyte RAM extension also here. There you have it, folks. We'll mark this project as a success and move on to the next one. Thanks for looking.